So I managed to pick myself up some Vector Oath 2s. Can I actually equip those right now? If I press options and then go to... I guess I can just hover over my gloves, can't I? So at the minute they do 15 defense and then these ones do... Oh, there's no difference between them. I guess I can just go for aesthetics then. Uh, oh, I can dismantle them as well. That's a thing. So I'm not... I don't know too much about the dismantling and the crafting inside of this game. But I can do that if I'd like to. Let's see. Uh, details... So it does 15 defense and that's that's it, it's just purely that. Let me just triple check that that doesn't have anything else. No, and I can dismantle those ones. Cool. I want to dismantle these just because, you know, I got these ones that I've just equipped from a quest. So I thought it might be quite nice to have those. So L1 and R1 to switch between these. So I've got myself some spine metal leaves last time and a warping claws as well. Uh, and then we just got general settings and then roster. I'm assuming that's your friends and party and stuff. Sweet. Well, I won't keep that up for too long because otherwise you're all going to add everybody on my friends list, <laughs> which I know does happen. So if we mouse over here, we can set a destination. Where do we want to go? So that's the tower. That's Earth. Uh, but I guess we can go down to old Russia if we wanted to. It's a shame that we can't go to the moon just yet. The crucible. Anywhere else we want to go. I'm assuming it's probably best to go towards the... Um, towards that we've got one message at the tower so let's make our way there let's find out what the tower is oh we're in oh fantastic oh look at me with all my stuff off nice so when you're outside of combat areas it looks like you can just sort of run around in a third person thing this is very cool so we've got a postmaster hello Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. Awesome. So we've got a message. Uh, message from Tess. Thank you for helping us test Destiny. This is our alpha test to make sure everything holds up under heavy loads. We couldn't do it without you. Ah, oh, cool. And I think I actually got 100 of whatever that thing is on the side. Are those little cube things the currency? Hmm. I guess we'll find out soon. Uh, do I want to talk to you? Confirmed. He's a bounty tracker. Hello. So you've got a couple of bounties. Uh, defeat 25 titans in the crucible. I can win three crucible matches, and I can defeat 15 guardians using a super. Oh God, that would be difficult, because obviously guardians are, are human players in this, basically. Well, not human, but, you know, real-life people like me and you actually playing in the game. That's what a guardian is. Uh, earn 9,000 experience without dying. Kill two enemies at once with a fusion rifle. 20 times, all right? It's not a big ask. And complete any strike without dying. Okay, so glimmer that's the currency of the city right so it was the currency cool. So let's get ourselves into the tower then does this not open? <laughs> How do I get in there? I don't have a blink or anything do I to get through there um, Around the side maybe Let's have a look yeah. over here. Let's speak to you the gunsmith All right, what do you got for us then mate? Uh, what does my current weapon have? I should probably Come check on. that before I try and so buy something on. My current weapon is uh, 36 attack and my shotty is 36 as well. Are those two different ones? I've got an auto rifle and a scout rifle. Okay. But I have to switch out on primary and He's secondary. But at least the secondary start. isn't just like a pistol. It is like another a fully fledged kick-ass gun. So ammo synthesis. Okay. Single-use ghost manufacturing package. Instantly replenishes primary ammunition. That would be handy actually if you're ever stuck in a corner. And then we've also got ammo synthesis, instantly replenishes special weapon ammunition. Hmm, I'll leave those for now. I don't, I'm not going to buy any of those. These weapons are only like three points higher than what I'm currently using. I don't think I'm going to notice too much of a difference if I upgrade to those. Uh, let's have a look over here. Who are you? The Cryptarch. So I think the Cryptarch is the guy that allows you to create things. So you will find these little things around the world from drops or you'll just find them randomly laying on the floor. Uh, which are actually kind of like schematics as far as I can remember. And you can basically use them cr to create all these different things. So let's try a... Let's try gauntlets. So I just bought some gauntlets. If I acquire that... Vector Oath 2. So can I now equip that? Let's see. Um, in, oh, actually, if I just go over the gloves, Vector Oath 2, all oh, right, okay, so those are slightly higher, so yeah, now I'm ready to wear those when I actually get to the right level. Let's buy myself one more Happy thing then. Help. Let's go for, hmm, armor piece, I can upgrade my weapons, maybe that's a good shout. I've only got just enough to do that. I'm going to upgrade my, uh, my heavy weapon. That sounds good. All right, cool. So let's see what we got from that. Let's go over to my weapon. So we've got 36 attack, 36 attack. Um, equipment. Let's see. So we've got Ghost and we've got the Sparrow. Oh, I didn't realize we had the Sparrow. Ah, okay. And we can hold L2 to sprint with the Sparrow. And that is all of that sort of stuff. Cool. Happy with that. 
Oh, wait, I see. Sorry. Derp. Herp derp. I just completely missed the little drop that's underneath the main gate. Ah, there we are. Yeah, this looks good. Oh, I see. A crucible handler. And then we've also got a crucible quartermaster. Okay. And this is the room that I've seen many, many a shot of uh, from little promo uh, screenshots of the game. There we go. Oh, select a reward. Oh, okay, so this is a reward for what we did earlier on. The Warping Claws, taken from the Defeated Thrall. Return these to the Vanguard Mentor. Okay. And I'm going to get myself a chess piece. Nice. Oh, I can select another reward. Uh, I would like some... We're just going to give us the highest defense. I mean, I just picked chest armor a second ago, so I'm going to go for a helmet. Don't put too much faith in armor. There we are. Don't put too much faith in armor. I know I, know I need skill. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> I know that, but... But still, 22 for 18, that's not too bad of an upgrade. But 18 for 41? Oh, man. What an upgrade. All right, cool. So let's find where we're going to head off to then. Let's, let's do set destination. So obviously, we've just come from the tower. And we've got Old Russia slash Earth to explore about. Uh, three missions. We've got the Dark Within, which I'm pretty sure is what we've just done, where we have to investigate the hidden power trapped in the Cosmodrome. Uh, and other than that, we have... Oh, Devil's Lair. That is a term I've actually heard before. But that is level six. That's a strike. And I do have an achievement, actually, uh, from that place, didn't I, where it said if I can do a strike without dying, then I'd be a badass. So I think that guess... I guess this leaves this one, doesn't it? We've got a level four explore. Scour the old Russian launch port and aid the city in their exploration efforts. I am totes down for that. Let's launch in. All right, we're in. Oh, this looks All right. familiar. This time we go wherever we want. Nothing oh. holding us back. So it's just open world now. Guardians have been planting beacons here to connect back to the tower. We find them. We can help the city. I'm oh, already sweet. detecting a few. Okay, show me where they're at, ghost. Ah, there is one over that way. Okay, cool. I'm digging that, so I can go in any way I want. And I'm pretty sure in this game, it's whatever I can see, I can go to, essentially. It's kind of got that whole, like, Skyrim mechanic. And if you see a mountain, like, you know, 5,000 meters away, you can climb up it if you want. It's totally down to you. I'm just trying to see how far I can get with this. So it seems like if I hold it, it does make me go up a little bit higher. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's take these guys out over here. Shots fired. Shots fired. I'm <laughs> just doing it mainly to scare them. Uh, oh, you little sneaky git. Let me just line up with you. It's quite weird, actually. I'm not crazy about this cross here. Just because I look at the top of the uh, of the inner of the inner little sort of like circle thing, and I assume that's where it should be. But the actual red dot site is in the center of it, not in the top of the uh, the peak. There you are. Come on, you buggers. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna throw a nade at you. Why not? So what does that do? I don't think it was close enough to take any damage. Yeah, you're a clever and you dodged out of the way. So if I use this, there we go. Oh, some guy's running around on a sparrow. Oh, I haven't got mine out yet, have I? I should probably do that. Uh, where are you at? Come here. Nice. Down you go. And there's still just one of you there. Thank you. Damn. At long range, the shotgun isn't proving to be too effective. I guess that's the same in real life and in any other game, but sometimes they can have quite a bit of distance on them. There you go, you're down. So this is one of those beacons. Get mission. Let's do it. Dead orbit needs your help, Guardians. We can't build our fleet alone. Encryption follows. Okay, which direction are we going in for this? Oh, damn. So what's happened to this guy? Oh, nice. Oh, dear. Should have reloaded. Down you are, mate. Thank you. Let's have a look. What's this? A temper cloth. Okay, so that's some more materials that we can use. Nice. It's cool that you don't have to press a key to pick them up. It's literally just a case of running straight over them. It's very, very handy. All right, where are we going to next then, Ghost? Where's your next closest one? Or will they only present themselves when we're close enough to them? Yeah, I think so. All right, how do we spawn the sparrow then? Summon vehicle. Let's hold square. Ah, here we go. So we've got L2 to do a boost, R2 to air brake. So if I, like, jump off an edge, will that just stop me, like, mid-air? So if I go there... Mm. I'm not noticing how the air brake works yet. I'm sure I'll get used to it. Let's have a little wonder about, can the sparrow go across water? No! <laughs> no, it cannot! <laughs> yep. Don't do that. Don't do that. You will die. Most definitely. Oh, dear. So, there you go. I've done goofed on that one. That's fine. Find fall, uh, kill Fallen and collect their temper cloth. Oh, I see! So, I've got to kill Fallen in this area. That's what our objective is. That makes sense now. Got you. Sweet. I can do that. There's quite a few of them around here anyway, aren't there? Chances are they might have respawned because I just died, <laughs> like, in this area. 
Uh, let's see, anybody else around? No, ah, yeah, there's some over there actually. Nice long shot. Good stuff. There you go. Oh, it's I'm just sort of like sneaking over the top there. Might see if I can do my big attack. I don't think I've actually done it yet on anything other than a wizard. Would quite like to do that. Let's give it a go. So if I go up. Nice. Oh, it normally goes third person when you do it. That's a shame. Let me try again. Oh. Oh, it's acting a little bit differently now. L1 and R1. Oh, maybe I'm all out. Mm, yeah, it seems like I'm actually out. So which bar on my screen is where I can see how much of my uh, warlock, essentially mana, I have. There you go. Oh, dear. God, they've got, like, some home-seeking missiles. Oh, I see. Supercharge. Right. And that means I can now do it. All right. You two are screwed. No. Oh, yep. Yeah, now they are. <laughs> okay. That works. Cool. Down you are, buddy. Uh, can I melee? What's melee? There must be a melee button, right? There has to be. I'll have to look it up on the uh, on the little document. Oh, there you are. Thank you. I'll suss out melee next time. All right, cool. Unless it's right stick in. Left stick is obviously to sprint. Maybe right stick is uh, is melee. But it doesn't seem to be doing it. I can't think of any other keys it would be. Square reload, circle crouch, triangle to switch weapon, X maybe? No, X is obviously jump. No, I don't know. It's fine. Maybe there isn't a melee in this game. Which would be an interesting choice. There we go. How am I doing on the temper cloth? 88%. Right, okay. I like that it does literally just give you the very raw basis of the quest. It doesn't give you like a quest title and who it's for and how much you need to get it and why they need so much temper cloth. It's not like Andre needs to make himself a nice tutu. Go get him lots of temper cloth from, you know, <laughs> from aliens and blah, 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 blah. It's just the raw stuff. Uh, let's go over this way. Let's explore, because that's the point of the mission so far. Ah, now why are they red? Are they supercharged as well? Or is that just literally a level thing? I think that might be their threat, actually. So when they're red, they're on par with me. When they're yellow, they should be able to go down pretty easily. And maybe there's a green one? Or this could all be utter nonsense, which it very much likely is. Uh, oh, there's one more just there. Let me try one of these. Nice. Down you go. Oh, he has melee. He has melee. Why don't I have melee? What is melee? I need to find it. All right, I should be done with my temper cloth after this. Yeah, 100%. Nice. Nice work. I'll let the city know we got it all. Sweet. I'm hoping that we don't have to go back up into orbit to come back down. We can just continue to explore and find ourselves another mission. Where's that next one at? There is one uh, 25 meters that way. That's handy. Oh, how did I not clock that? It's a big green flashing thing. The future war court is offering bounties for items from this location. Mm. Encrypted message follows. And please, keep this quiet. Kill drag specimens and collect their nerve interface docking caps for study. Okay. So there's a way for me to... Oh, who's attacking me? Is he around there? Oh, there he is. Good bugger. There we are. All right. Oh, sweet. So he's actually just off the exact same guys. Okay. Uh, was someone shooting me from that way? Pretty sure there was. Yeah, there he is. Uh, there they are. Good stuff. My aiming's actually been pretty on par so far. Been happy with that. <laughs> oh, dear. What's going on? Oh, it's a world event. Event incoming optional. Defeat extraction crews. Oh, sweet Jesus. Where are they? Oh, Christ. <laughs> this is terrifying. Where are they? Where's a ship? I can hear something. It sounds like it's directly in front of me. Oh, yeah, that might be what it was. Do I have to fly around to that side or have they just dropped in near me? Oh, Jesus. All right, hold on then. Let's get ourselves over there. I want to go find out what the hell that was all about. There must be another way out the side of this building, right? We'll go through here. We'll pop up out the other side and see if the event's there. Oh, no, wait, wait. Hold on. There's a marker for it. Oh, I see. Perfect. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? And is that the progress of the event so far? So it looks like uh, USMC Postal is already on it. Yeah, okay, cool. I'm going in. I'll forget about the docking caps for now. Let's see what we've got to deal with. Oh dear, where is it? It's not underneath the ground, so I don't know where he's off to. Ah, I see. Hello. Uh, let me try a big attack on you guys. Oh, no. Shot a little bit short there. So it does actually have a dip on that ability. That's interesting. Nice. Yeah, take that, you buggers. 
Where are they? Cool. And I think there's another one around the side of this thing. No? I think this might actually be counted towards my normal quest as well. Yeah, come back here, you. Thank you. Oh, I see. My ability is just slowly moving upwards. Oh, dear. Is that going to blow? Hopefully not. Hold on a second. I'm just going to jump up here. So I've cleared one of the three drill sites. Where's the next one at? Uh, God, I don't see it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That way. Got it. Oh, now I've got to deal with all the normal mobs as well. On top of it. All right. That's fine. I can do that, I think. Just got to make sure that I do it within the time limit. Uh, actually, I'm going to have to skip them. I don't know if that's 50 seconds to do all three sites, or if it's 50 right. seconds Updating just to do the one. Is he a guardian? No, he's not. No, he certainly is not. Oh, damn. All right. Oh, I'm not supercharged yet, so I can't... All right. So it's nice that the supercharge doesn't come up, like, crazy frequently. I need to take down this Severiter. Uh, oh, damn. Oh, yeah, I'm going to get attacked from all angles here. I need to try and find some cover. Hold on. Let me get up here. 20 seconds. Oh, no. Uh, oh, God. Where is he? Come on. There we are. Is that the drill site cleared? Not really, no. Ah, the servitor is what's causing me all the problems. And he also has a blink as well. That's not helpful. <laughs> not in the slightest. No, I don't think I managed it. Maybe that's one of those kinds of events that requires numerous people. Ah. Next time. Yeah, next time. There's always next time. At least I got a couple of glimmers out of it, though. Like, four. <laughs> that was probably just for that last kill that I got. You're not getting away, you're not. You've caused me too many hassles to live. I will take you down if it's the last thing that I do. Uh, where's he gone? I bet he's going to be behind me, isn't he? Or is he legit just disappeared? Oh, man. God, this soundtrack. It's just about blowing my head off. All right, so it seems like the event's legit over. Okay, so is that me all done? Got to use this to detect a couple more quests then. Oh, we go inside of here like we did before. Ah, hey, hey, hey is he attacking me? There's no PvP in this, is there? Let me double check. Uh, no, it's not. He's just attacking those guys. All right, cool. Up we get. Well, that was fun. I <laughs> just, just finished an event and failed it miserably. It's only because there was a little bit of confusion. It's my first one though, so I'm allowed that. I allowed that for the first time. All right, let's see what we got. So there's a mission just in this direction by the looks of it. Oh, uh, over the gap. And then drop off. Which way are we going? Ah, there is something that way. And there's also a path going down this way as well. We're in dock 13. Oh, dear. Nope. Wrong one. <laughs> I'm nearly at supercharged, though, so that's fine. I tried doing both of them. Let's try a normal one. Nice. So by the looks of it, I don't think my normal one... Oh, I see. It has a recharge time. Awesome. So now, yeah, I can do it again. So it's actually the, what, the thing that looks like the Ubisoft logo. <laughs> you know, the thing to the left of my weapon in the bottom left corner of the screen. I'm assuming when that fills, that's when I can actually do one of them. And level five. Oh, ding. Fantastic. Right, which way were we going? It was that way, wasn't it? Oh, upgrade unlocked. Okay, they're not going to respawn anytime soon, are they? So let's upgrade. What do we want? So we can't upgrade to that. We just got that. Okay. A powerful melee attack which drains energy. Oh, okay, cool. Awesome. The only problem is it doesn't tell me what key it's bound to. Those ones bind. Let me just very quickly check. 